Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. This week I attended to the Copilot Studio Architecture Bootcamp organized by Microsoft Power Cat Team. It was an amazing experience and I learned a bunch of cool tricks that can make your agent smarter and more useful. And one of these tricks, which what I'm sharing today is dynamic knowledge routing. This will help your agent to give accurate and personalized answers based on user context, in this case, user location. So here is the challenge. Let's say you have a SharePoint site with the leave policies for different countries, and you use this knowledge source in your agent. A user interacts with the agent by asking, what's the leave policy? agent doesn't know where they are from so it picks a random knowledge source and that's kind of frustrating of course there are workarounds that we can make this uh, kind of work for example we can add better system instructions we can have a topic to capture the user location by asking user but there is a pretty straightforward fix the fix is for example, we capture uh, most of the user details at the start of the conversation by using conversation starter uh, topic. This will help. Uh, this helps us to capture user ID, user email, user name, etc. And we can capture the user location by using Microsoft Entra ID to fetch this information automatically, and then use that information as a variable making a global variable actually to uh, use that with an agent then we can use that variable to dynamically filter search sharepoint knowledge source with the user location and we can also add a system instruction to make sure that the agent always follow these instructions so let me show you uh, in action so here is my agent and I am using a leave policy SharePoint uh, folder as a knowledge source. If I go to SharePoint, here is my folder and I have leave policies for different countries like USA, India, Germany, France, etc. So if I come to my agent and if I ask a question, for example, what's the leave policy? So as soon as I ask a question, for example, what's the leave policy? The agent picks the right knowledge source here, which is Germany. Why Germany? If I go to Azure, here is my office location, which is Germany. If I change this to USA, France, this will pick the knowledge source for those countries. So right now, let's say I'm in USA, it picks USA. If I change to Germany, it picks Germany. If you have colleagues, let's say in India, whenever they ask questions, the agent will pick the uh, leave policy for India. So let's see how we do this. To do that, uh, let's go to topic. And you can either use your system topic conversation starter because this is automatically captures the user uh, details at the start of the conversation because it says on conversation start or you can create a new topic so I actually created a new topic and for somehow as soon as I change that to on start it uh, became a system topic if I go to office location so here is my uh, custom topic uh, called office location and you can see it's on conversation start so to ease a way to make this on conversation start you can come to uh, code edit editor and change the trigger to on conversation start so as soon as I change that on conversation start my custom topic became actually system topic so uh, I don't know why, but this was the experience I have. And after that, I just added a tool and go to connector and look for Microsoft Entra 
ID get user and you will choose get user Microsoft Enter ID and once you select it uh, go to properties uh, for end user authentication I choose make a provider credentials inputs I selected the user ID which is a system variable and then for outputs then to use this variable uh, within the agent we can make this a global so just click and then make this global and the variable name you can see global get user and then we can go to topics again I created another uh, custom topic which is leave policy and the instruction here use this tool for questions about leave policy time off etc and then I added a note which is a create generative answers for input uh, you can choose activity text this basically captures the user's last message uh, to use uh, as a variable and then click edit and make sure you select search only selected sources but don't select any knowledge sources here because we will have a logic here so extend classic data and on the classic data look for SharePoint and you can see it from here and change that to uh, formula not manual input and if you look at formula here we are basically using SharePoint uh, with leave policies folder and concatenating with the that global variable which captures the office location and after that we have uh, system instructions let's go there so I'm saying always start by triggering the office location topic which we have it's a custom and always append the user country this is our global variable in knowledge search queries so you can see this is when I ask what's the leave policy it said Germany and if I go back here if I change that to USA save I ask for example what are the employee benefits it's going to pick the right country which is uh, employee benefits at Contoso USA the reason because my location is USA I changed uh, from Germany to uh, USA so here is a question what are the employee benefits the agent picks the right data source which is Contoso in the USA and if I scroll down you can see the leave policy for USA and here is the query and here is the response so by capturing this location the agent can filter the right knowledge source and bring the appropriate information so we are capturing that information if I go to topics system again you can capture this in conversation starter because that's on start but I created the office location which is a custom topic but somehow it became a system topic and if I go to variables and global if I look at the get user which is a record and value and you can see the user office location is USA so this is really great and helps users to get personalized information why go through all this first of all accuracy the agent gives the right answer every time second personalization users feel like the agent understands them third efficiency no need for users to keep clarifying their location and last one scalability you can apply the same approach for other attributes like department job role or even language 
Hope this uh, was helpful. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel, like this video. And if you have any thoughts, comments, please put them in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.